Our coverage continues in Lubbock of the 2022 Big 12 Cross Country Championships. We just got done witnessing a record from Oklahoma State's women with 22 points for the convincing title. Can the men complete the sweep as they did a year ago in Stillwater? Like Oklahoma State is hoping for a dominant performance that like we saw on the women's side where they actually set a Big 12 record for the lowest point total ever recorded in the championship with 22 points. Um, there's a lot of question marks, I think, in this men's race, so we'll see if they can nab a low score like that. It should be really exciting. What a race run by Alex Mayer with the support of his teammates for a while in the pack. But Alex Mayer in the back half kicking it into gear, looks over his shoulders and sees a sea of orange and black. And uh, Fouad Masadi making a, an impressive push for second place behind Alex Mayer. Mayer really proving he's the top distance runner in the Big 12 and one of the best in the country with a dominating win. Masadi coming in for second. And now we're going to see that sea of orange for Oklahoma State. Oklahoma State women already victorious today. The men looking to join them for another sweep like last year. But here in Lubbock, it's Alex Mayer, your individual champion in the Big 12. But what a race run by that pack following him. But the Cowboys have already locked it up. Five of the top seven finishers, Leonard Rodriguez, Masudi along with Shoppy, make it a Cowboy-Cowgirl sweep for the team titles in the Big 12. Yeah, Oklahoma State took eight of the top 14 finishes unofficially, so that is going to preclude anybody else from having a low point total. You see the Cyclones look to be our second-place finishers here in 2022. Texas, as a team, will look to complete the podium in third. It is a Cowboy-Cowgirl sweep, including an individual for the men of the Cowboys.